Hey, it's Chasing Sons, and we're back playing Ninu Kuni Wrath of the White Witch. Um, this is my first time playing, and everybody keeps telling me that I need to play it, so here I am. <laughs> um, ooh, easy or normal? What should I play? E, but as will be easier, recommend for players who prefer to focus on the story. Oh, I love this story. This is dip, uh, default setting. You can expect to enjoy some challenging battles. I don't know, because I'm not a pro gamer, and like... <laughs> you just don't know. Let's just play normal. No. Yeah, let's go ahead and play normal. Let's play normal. I feel like I can do this, okay? There's little kids playing these games, okay? This is the pressure's too real. I'm just not as good, all right? If you came here to watch Pro Gamer, it's just not happening. It's not happening, okay? All right, let's go ahead and calm down. This is supposed to be beautiful. All right. Oh, I love it. Get a move on, Ollie boy! Slow down, Mr. Drippy. But Ding Dong Dells just on the way! So this game huh? is actually paired huh? with um, Studio Ghibli. I don't know oh. if you all know that, huh? but Studio Ghibli actually um, helped them with this game. What do we do? Run for it! Ah! Ah! Oh my God, it looks like a bunch of potatoes. <laughs> This is beautiful. This game here is so beautiful. This is your world. That's right. Uh, well, how he's like, this, I'm beautiful. Or, I said this beautiful, is beautiful. And now he's like, oh, this is your world. <laughs> I love it. Okay. A level five game. Yes, feature animation by Studio Ghibli. So everything is hand drawn. I don't know if you guys um, know like the history of Studio Ghibli or anything like that, but um, I'm definitely new to the world of anime and everything within the past year. And it's been the fantasy ride that I love and that I have fallen in love with. And uh, watched a Studio Ghibli documentary, and I did not know this um, that they hand draw everything. Um, Everything is just how they use how, how they started is how they're doing it now. Everything's hand drawn first. So I really love that. So it's funny, it's like when people create a business or create something that's, you know, art or whatever, it, you notice things stand time. Like it's timeless when they not necessarily remain the same, but when they stick to their ways of how they do things and what makes them successful. Like what really like where their heart comes through, so that that's beautiful to see that Studio Ghibli is still hand drawing everything. So this is a beautiful intro. Kokoro no Ka Oh, I didn't get to read it. <laughs> Honestly, I love that they have, like, I, I'm in the United States, so like everything is backwards, right? So like the credits are always at the end. So I love that credits technically are always in the beginning of anime and the games and stuff. I think that's awesome. You should definitely, you know, give thanks to everybody that created it. All right, welcome to Motoville. <laughs> oh, I really want to watch a Studio Ghibli movie now. I mean, I kind of am, right? <laughs> but I'm in it. Hi, this is so cute. Oh, it's morning, cheap, Ms. 10 Layla. pounds for 35 Why, cents. Good morning, Oliver. Your groceries are over there, honey. Thanks. Oh, I almost forgot. Did Philip find you? He said he had something to show you, dear. Really? So he finally finished it, huh? Do you know where he is right now? He just stepped out with some deliveries for me. I doubt he'll have gotten far. Thanks, Miss Layla. Oh, say hi to your mother for me. Sure thing. Okay. Hello. Oh, it's Phil. Hi, Phil. <laughs> I they can hear me. L to walk over to Phil. Okay. All right, we're gonna walk over to Phil. Good. Oh, good thing you found me. Guess what? She's finally ready. So, what Miss Layla said is it really what I think it is? 
What else would it be, dum dum? Boy, you are something else, Phil. So what do we do now? What else? We take our first spin tonight. What? Tonight? Well, I can. I mean, oh, I love I Studio Ghibli, and I love their music and everything about them. Sure, sure. You go ask your. It's just mom. so pure. And then when do we do it, huh? Next Tomorrow? year. Next. Well, I. <laughs> no, but. Okay, we'll do it tonight, but we'll have to be real quiet. Sure, we will. Sure. Okay, tonight. <laughs> Sure. <laughs> okay. So, this is the child. Oh, I was not. I, okay, so I actually haven't watched any gameplay on this, so I was not expecting this. Hmm. The dark jinn's power alone will not suffice. I fear not. What is the child's name? Oliver, your radiance. Oliver. Okay, so I did read online because I did want to like look up some like tips and tricks on like what I need to do. Um, and they said there's like mini games or like tasks I need to complete into like, or I guess objectives, I guess that would be the right word. Um, but to make sure I do all of them and complete all of them so um, I can collect everything I really need for the game. Okay, but how do I get there? What do I do? Okay, okay, I'm just gonna keep going. Okay, hello? Oh, hi. Oh, gee, I'm sure I'm forgetting something, but I can't. Okay, I guess we're not really talking to you. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Wait, what did it say at the top? Oh, gee, okay. Okay, I gotta take her to her home. <laughs> okay, but where's her home? This music makes me think I'm at Disney. Who else is a Disney freak? I am. I live and breathe Disney, okay? It's just the fantasy I live in. I mean, you have to. It's 21st century, okay? Everything is really... Not necessarily everything is sad, okay? But the, it's what keeps me going every day. <laughs> ah! Oh, oh, her house is right here. Okay. Oh, I keep trying to, like, move my camera around, but it's just not happening, obviously. <laughs> hey, Mom. I got the groceries. Thanks, sweetie. Just pop them on the table, will you? Say, Mom, mm -hmm. did you say something, sweetie? Um, you're kind of busy tomorrow, huh? Well, now that you mention it, I do have to practice for my concert in the morning. Oh, yeah? So, you'll be in bed kind of early, huh? Mm -hmm. uh, yes, I suppose I will. Oh, you will, huh? <laughs> well, you stop that being looks so like turkey bacon. <laughs> and eat your breakfast. You'll be late for school. And chew before you swallow. I'm not gonna say it. <laughs> if you know, you know. Thanks for breakfast, Mom. See you later, Mom. Bye, sweetie. You be good now. I will. Um, so yeah, so we're not gonna tell my mom. <laughs> All right. I thought you were a good kid. I guess not. All right, let's just keep going. But yeah, the cutscenes are really long, but it's all about the story. I mean, I'm here to really like watch the story more than play the game just because I love Studio Ghibli. Um, let me know what you guys think down below uh, um, about the storyline. Um, are you here for the storyline, for the game, or both? Or what do you think? <laughs> all right, so mom's asleep. Okay, Oliver has to go out. Okay, press X to open the main menu. Okay, for the person with a range of options. Okay, so I can use that for the options and press A. Pressing B, okay, great. Okay, cool, so I can save at any point, which is great. Okay, cool, that's great. <laughs> It's not like it takes two where you know in the middle of the game and then you gotta start all over. All right, cool. So we can use the main menu now. Um, so I gotta press X for the main menu. So, um, cool. So I guess I have to collect these items. So I have to go through these objectives. Okay, so we're just gonna go down. I'm gonna go straight to the star.
basically I want to keep going to the star. Oh wait, when me uh Okay, so I have to I'm guessing I have to collect these items. I have to find these items. Gosh, this is going to be hard. I only have that great memory. <laughs> I hope I actually finish like all the objectives in each level or town or whatever. I know um, they were talking about like you like you leave the city or something and then just make sure you go back and there was something about a boat. I don't know. We'll get there when we get there, right? <laughs> all right, cutscene. Oh, there's a girl. You know what that kid looks like? He reminds me of... Uh, Polar Express, the kid in the beginning. <laughs> what is it with that? <laughs> what kept you, Slowpoke? Sorry, my mom just wouldn't go to bed. So, is it finished? Sure is. The last bearing's in, and she's primed for action. Wanna see? Do I ever? All right. Here goes nothing. Okay. Whoa. Wow. Oh, is this neat? Oh, this is so Oh, this looks you great. Betcha. This kind of looks like, oh my gosh, which studio get the movie? <laughs> the new Coop Deluxe ain't got nothing. And where they're like in the sky. Oh, I feel like that's all of them. It's not even close. So, you ready to hit the road, kiddo? Yeah. <laughs> just don't know why we can't hear them talking. I wonder if that's just a setting. Because we were able to hear them, now we can't. All right, so who's gonna drive first? If you're down the street, make sure the coast is clear, and I'll let you go first. You mean that? Oh boy, blah blah blah. All right, so Oliver, the character I'm playing, I'm gonna be driving first, and Philip is gonna be on the lookout to the olds. <laughs> All right, so let me go check on her first. Beep. <laughs> All right, the coast is clear. I better go tell Phil. Don't go. What? Huh? It's bad. Please, Oliver. Wait, who's this go. girl? Huh? That's not the girl Who from the window. How do you know my name? She kind of looks like a ghost. Ollie. The way What's she's glowing. What's taking you so long? I'm sorry, Phil. Someone saw me. Oh man. Who was it? Oh, uh. Some girl. girl. Oh, she's like a spirit or something. About? What? There's nobody there. Huh? That's weird. She was right there. She a was girl. right there. I have it on recording. Girl, huh? mm -hmm. I bet it was that dumb, scary Mary. Oh no, couldn't be. She's not allowed out. You must be going screwy or something. Anyway, come on. Oh, oh. <laughs> I love how he just had like a running start. <laughs> we love the energy. Okay, that's okay. Maybe we should, oh, we should uh, definitely listen to our spirits though. <laughs> the boy who will save the world. But unfortunately. Light is yet a mere candle in the blackness. Indeed. He may be the child the prophecies speak of, but he is a child nonetheless. Yet these humans can be disturbingly powerful. Children are living the their life like they were born just yesterday, entirely. which is great. Might this one not prove equally Don't underrate them. Tenacious. What would you have me do, Lady? Such saplings must not be suffered to grow. Very well. I love her bodysuit. Or it's her skin. I'm not really sure. <laughs> Alright. He who would save this doomed world must die. Alright, mom. Mom's gonna know that we're gone. Moms are just weird. It's like they know. They really do know. They're just connected. It's because we were connected to them. <laughs> uh, sweetie? Uh-oh. And this is where I get in trouble. Where are you? Oh, no. Am Oliver? I going to play mom now? Um, 
you're kind of busy tomorrow, huh? Well, now that you mention it, we make it so easy for our parents to figure out things. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh so my gosh. I'm too old for it, but my mom still figures things out like this. <laughs> I don't mean to be sneaky. It just happens. I'm like, I didn't mean to hide things from me. I'm just wondering what you were doing. <laughs> uh, remember, parents don't know what they're doing. They're just older versions of us. They're still trying to figure it out as much as we are trying to figure it out and vice versa. All right, Oliver and Phil. All right, yeah, Oliver, you're going to put a... Come on. Oh, am I going to drive? <laughs> I'm not doing anything. This is still a cutscene. The colors kind of remind me of Curious George. This is how it happens. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. Oh my god, am I gonna end up in the creek? <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my god. Obviously, I'm not gonna die. Well, I don't know, because I gotta save the world. Maybe I'm, I'm gonna, like, die, like, it must be a spirit or something. Look, look at mom. Mom's gonna try to save me, and she can't. What if she can't swim? We're SOL. Philip, no. Oh, I'm so in trouble. Oh, mom got me out. Oliver? That was my Oliver, poor... <laughs> Accent. My poor accent. Mom? Aww. Oh, sweetie, I'm so glad you're okay. Uh, I'm sorry, Mom. I'm sorry. I swear, if I'd known, I never would have. Don't be silly, Phil. What about your car? That hunk of junk, I can make another one in no time. Well, I think you two Aww. He's such a good friend. I really thought he was going to be like, you ruined my car. <laughs> I thought he was gonna be like a bad kid or something. Oh no, what's going on with mom? Why do they have to do this every time? Studio Ghibli, Disney movies, all of them. They always just have to rip your heart out. No pun intended because your heart is getting, you know, hurt. But. No. Don't let anything happen to her. It's not cool. Just let me live in a fantasy that everything's gonna be okay. This is what you get oh, for running out, Oliver. Mom. You'll be okay. I know you will. That's what they always say, and then, you know, they... For me. No! I do do that! Why would they do that? I just want to live in a fantasy. I hate when they do this. Yeah. Oh. And then my sick mind is like, okay, maybe if I like finish all the tasks, mom's gonna come back to life and it was just a dream or something. Sentimental fool. <sighs> Sacrificing herself to save her child. And yet thanks to her, the boy lives. Oh, but shorn of his mother's love, to whom can he now turn for guidance? Exactly. And soon he will come to our world, where our powers are strongest. Very good, your radiance. Mm. Oh, look at that to leg. See how the story unfolds. I'm sure the ending will be engaging. Oh. Hmm. What does that mean? <laughs> Was that the intro? Was that everything? And now we're going to play? Or we're going to have more long cutscenes? I'm curious. Oliver, honey, I brought you some apple pie. I'll just leave it here for you, okay, dearie? 
Aww. So sad. If I wasn't recording right now, I'd probably be bawling my eyes. <laughs> oh no. That cat. Mm, it's like Garfield. You'll just have to wait and tell dinner, Timmy told her. Oh, Timmy told drum. <laughs> He's been in there three whole days now. I feel that. I understand. Oli. I'll be your mom, Oli. I was not expecting Mom's that. Not job today. She's asked someone very special to take care of you. It's funny when you lose a parent, you really do have those memories of just sure happiness of things that they've done for you. So this is pretty spot on. Be good while mommy's away, okay? Just kind of remember all the good things like that. Mommy. At least that's how it was for me. Something wrong, sweetie? Mm -hmm. Just come back soon, okay? Of course, sweetie. We'll always be together, Oliver. That's true. Always. Doesn't matter where she is, they're always together. <laughs> this is so sad. Come back. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. What's going on? Oh, it's the little character we saw in the beginning. <laughs> no wonder you look a little silly wedding. <laughs> oh my god, I gotta be careful laughing on my desk. My desk is super wobbly. <laughs> Tiny, I'm free. Tiny, I'm free. <laughs> oh, that was a great turn. What just happened? You just witnessed the rebirth of Drippy, Lord High, uh, Lord of the Fairies. Um, who? What are you deaf or something? Drippy, Lord High, Lord of the Fairies. I said, didn't I? Drippy. Drippy. That's right. And I'm sick to the teeth of you were sniveling and moaning. A proper baby <laughs> bunting you are. That's right. We don't need no sugar coaters around here. You were crying for three old days. I'm surprised there's a drop of water left in you. You're a big boy, man. Three days is, well, it's a new dog. I love how he just has a lantern on his nose. Oh, yeah, a bit flummoxed, a wee bit lost for words. Not to worry, man, I got all the answers. Oh, but app prepares. Is he about to use pie? All this is going to take a while. Ready? Uh-huh. Tidy. I like your style. Very honest, anyway. Stay that way, okay? Take you far, I will. <laughs> on with the show! Oh. Okay. See, it's like this, see? What it is, is there's more worlds out there than this one by Earth. There's what you might call parallel worlds, see? They're like worlds along by the side of you or one. And one of those worlds is my world. That's right, the whole nother world. Another world? That's quick you are. And I, that is the Lord High Lord of the Fairies, the reason I'm by her in this world of viewers, well, it's because there's a proper bad apple trying to upset the peace of both our worlds, see? Shada, the Dark Jinn, his name is, and what he did was he took over people's hearts and spread war and ruin all over our world. Tried to stand up to him, I did, and he turned me into a flipping doll <laughs> and kicked me out of our world and into you as the rotter. Uh-huh. And then you went and cried all over me and poof, the curse was lifted just like that. Which makes me think you must be the one we fairies call the pure hearted one. The one Aww. the legends say will save our world. Just goes to show you can't judge a book by its cover, eh? So, anyway, that means <laughs> I better get you over to our world and have you get rid of Shadar for us. All right with you? Me? Shadar for but us. How can I? Don't fret, man. It's a big responsibility, I know, but you'll be all right, especially with me to help you. But I. Oh, want me to ask properly, do you, Fedus? What? Oh, pure hearted one, will you please come and save our world? <laughs> He's like, do I need to make it any clearer? Uh, um, <laughs> come on, you can do this. You no. have nothing left. Let's just do it. Where's dad? Sorry, I must I have seen dad. You. What did you say? Go on, Mom's not around. You have one choice now. I won't to do change it. the world. Save it. I, I mean, I can't do it. This why? is why you should never work with children. Probably I ask nicely and you we're give doing me a it. Hearty because I'm playing yes, Ollie and we're going to make it happen. Works, see? <laughs> Gee whiz, that would be swell, you say. It's just how these things are done. It's tradition. How am I supposed to work with this? It's like he's never read a story in his life. But I don't know oh anything my gosh. about the world. And I just can't right now. What, because <laughs> you and Mom dropped dead? <gasps> <Yeah>. <laughs> I thought I was harsh. 
Uh, Hurry up, uh, will you? I haven't got all day. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, he's got the four too. Let's see now. Blimey. It can't be. But then it can't be a coincidence, neither. What is it? The great sage Alicia. Then we might uh, just be able to save you, ma'am. Huh? Yes! What are you talking about? You ready for another year full? Yes. Yeah. I want to know the what happens to mom. I want to bring her back to life. And my world are connected, which means people from over by you have another version of themselves over by there called a soulmate. I wish this was See? possible. And people with soulmates can even look like each other. Now, you and mom, well, she shared a soul with the great sage Alicia. A proper talent really she was. Right, so huh? maybe it is so possible. So my mom was a sage? <laughs> but how does that help us save her? Well, Alicia tried to take on the Dark Jinn, but his power was too much for her, and he trapped her in this dark jewel called the Soul Snare. When that happened, then the link between hers and you and Mam's souls would have been cut off. But if you Aww. could free Alicia, it just might fix the yes. link. And who knows, it might even bring your Mam back. Is that really true? I can't be sure now, but it's possible, yeah. Wait. How do you know all this, Mr. Drippy? You've been a doll this whole time. Ah, now there's clever of you. Good question, lad. It's like this, see? I'm not the only fairy. Even though I was stuck by you, my buddies were keeping me abreast of all the goings on over there. How? I suppose it's what you might call telepathy. And that's not all. I was sending my lordly <laughs> orders back over there, too. Really having them spy on Shadar. On that, you know, tidy, huh? Hmm? What is it? I'll... I'll do it. I'll come to your world. I'll come with you and save my mom. Oh, there's what marvelous. happens if mom is... Might be doing it for what all happens the wrong if he just doesn't get to save mom? Like, world, he, he just won't look saves Alicia in the mouth. the sage queen or whatever we better get going then. Chop, chop. Like, okay. how are you going to feel? You got to prepare yourself, uh, bro. How do we get to your world? I know he's like, what? Like oh, six? curious, are we? <laughs> all right, I'll tell you. First thing we need is a drop of magic. Okay. Go and have a dig around in the fireplace. There's something hidden there so nosy parkers won't find it. Okay. But why would anybody hide something in there? Aye, right, let's just do that's it all. That's for me to know and you to find out. Look lively. Yep, let's go. Chop, chop. <laughs> all right. A spell book in the fireplace. Go check it out. All right. So let's go down here. Do do. Oh, no. I almost went outside. Um, fireplace is probably over here. Okay. What could be hidden in a place like this? A mighty spell book! Huh? A book? But it would burn in there. Not this book. The wizard's companion laughs in the face of fire. Wouldn't be much of a spell book if it didn't, now, would it? Really? <laughs> Aha, gotcha. looks like a mole. An anteater with a lantern on its face. <laughs> okay. Why? <laughs> you guys didn't know this book was this here this whole time? This is a spell book? <laughs> that there is the wizard's companion. The fount of all wizarding knowledge. The wizard's companion. Okay. You obtained the wizard's companion. All right, so that was actually one of the items I needed. Now listen up, I'm going to teach you what's what in the wizard's companion is. If you want to have a read of it, press X to open the main menu, and then you should see it. And press A to come in and to skim through a few pages. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, okay, you have to make a pledge. To vow, okay, that you're worthy of being a withered wizard. Um, write your name in the book with an open, honest heart. And you don't even have to write Oliver if you don't want. You can write Bunting, Crybaby, or whatever you like. The important thing is that you mean it. Scribble your name down. Okay, I'm gonna put Chasing Sense. Okay, let's do it. But it's supposed to have a little Z. All right. So we made a vow. Right, magic in our way over to my world, is it? Hmm, now let's see. Where's the maid at? Or the Where nanny? Whatever she is. We got a wand somewhere by here. We can't go she casting spells we're out. without a wand now, can we? A wand? Why would we have a wand? Oh, that's a pain. Ah, well, can't be helped. We just have to look for one outside. I think huh? we'll find it. We won't find one out there either. Don't nitpick, crybaby bunting. Bunting? <laughs> My name is Oliver. Oliver. Ah, so the crybaby bit was right, at least, was it? Ah. <sighs> okay. Right, oh, time to find ourselves a magic wand. All right, so wait, I need to check the yard first. Uh, it's, it's just, I just have a poor accent, I swear. 
Okay, is it like, is it supposed to stick out? Ooh, let's talk to this lady. Okay. Alright, so she cleaned up all the twigs. Okay, let's just keep going. Well, uh, let's go across the street first. Okay, can't go in there. Wait, was I supposed to follow him? Is he supposed to lead me to the twig? Okay. Am I supposed to follow him? I don't know. <sighs> okay. see bottomless bag um, okay bottomless bag okay cool um so we need to go this way though right oh wait let's do this oh oh look at all these tickets i've obtained Oh, <laughs> wow. You see, that's what I mean. It's where I struggle, okay? <laughs> like, distraction, actually. All right. Um, sticks, anybody? I wonder what this stick looks like. Is it going to be like a stick stick? Does that make sense? Am I supposed to be clicking on things? I don't know. Uh, okay. Why is he so cute? Okay, okay, okay. Okay. So I have to stay by here for the outside search. Oh, is it the girl? Alright, let's talk to her. You're, you're the little girl I met before, huh? Mm-hmm. We met before. She's so cute. So, how do you know who I am? I'm really, really sorry, Oliver. Huh? Your mummy. I'm sorry. I couldn't save her. That's so sweet. Huh? I don't... Why would you be sorry for that? I wanted to save her. I really did. Huh? Hey, wait. Where are you... going? Hey, where did you go? Ollie boy! Why are you talking to thin air? Mr. Drippy, she disappeared again. <laughs> Mr. Drippy didn't even see huh? her. Who did? That strange girl. You just open. That's you just the open a little bit more. Tried to talk to me. What's that? A girl? Where? You're right about strange. I can't see her any flipping where. Well, how could you? She disappeared into thin air. Well, anyway. And she came before his I mother died, so we can't blame it on, like, is? maybe that he's in denial or anything. Uh, so. Sure, go ahead. Do you mind, it, you stance. know, having a sidekick, like? Huh? A sidekick? Who do you mean? Crikey, that's cold. <laughs> Who do you mean, he says? Why not stab me in the heart while you're at it? <laughs> I love how traumatic I mean, he is. Me. I wanted to know if it was all right me joining you on your adventures. <laughs> or if you were maybe wanting to trade me in for a younger, prettier model. But it looks like I got my answer, huh? <laughs> well, so you know, if you don't have faith in people, you never <gasps> see stick. their true worth. And what's more? Look at this. Huh? Blah, blah, blah. We ground. found the stick. Right where that girl was standing. <laughs> Chuck it here, then. Ta. Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. A it's monkey's a wand. Uncle. You mean it? A real wand? Come over by here and take a look, man. It might seem like any old stick, but it's got all magic writing on it. See? It does, huh? Wow. Is that how people ride in your world? The runes are all faded, so it might have lost a bit of power. But, for our current purposes, it's a beauty. Neato. Neato. What a stroke of luck. Luckier than you know, <laughs> Ollie boy. Phew, I never thought we'd actually find one. Do you think <laughs> I just maybe that girl some... brought it here for me? Aw, uh, maybe. <laughs> An old stick. Right. Yay. No. All right. To cast gateway, you need somewhere proper massive. You need space to give it oomph. See? 
Do we really so we have need to cast a spell. Mm -hmm. yeah, yes, what we kind do. of question is that? Come on, Ollie. You have to cast spells Get in your the head best together. environment possible. What were you born yesterday? <laughs> you really are new to this, anyway. This is beginner stuff we're talking about here. Oh, uh. Now, take me somewhere with plenty of space. It's got to be somewhere around by you. Um, the town square, I guess. All right, let's lead the way. So this is really great. Like, I feel like so far any age could play this game, right? Um, I don't know if you want your, like, little kid knowing that their parent's going to die. But, um, yeah. So that's called cross the street real fast. Um, but this is easy. This is not so hard. I thought this was going to be really hard. I don't know. I definitely, like, stressed out a little bit too much before I played this game. Do you really <laughs> think we should be doing this here? No worries, man. Normal people can't see magic, see? Go on, Ollie boy. Cast gateway. Um... All right, so we need cast gateway, open up the door that transports the caster between the worlds. All right, I hope I don't have to do anything special. Because I don't know. That's it, man, you got it! I really feel like I'm watching a Studio Ghibli movie. Uh... Whoa. Whoa. All right, gateway. Remember that oomph. Awesome. This is so cool. Does anybody see this? Like all these people on the street, do you see this? <laughs> oh, okay. So they do. Th oh, oh, the dog sees it, but she doesn't. All right. Yeah, because they're a little bit more spiritually connected, right? Yeah. Let's get a something, crybaby bunting. For the last time, it's Oliver. Crybaby bunting. <laughs> Oh my god, this is so cool. Hey, wait, wait for me. This is awesome. Oh my god, I really love this game so far. I haven't done much either. It's just the storyline. It's just really cute. And everything about it is beautiful. Okay, this is where we land. <sighs> right. Let's get going, shall we? This poor hey, guy lost me. his mom three days ago, and look, we're out here trying to save the world. So this is your world. Ah, home at last. But there's a tidy way to go yet. Hey, Mr. Drippy, that was pretty neat just now, huh? Oh, that herd of elk. Enjoy your first encounter with the elk. majestic wildlife <laughs> of our mysterious world, did you? Uh -huh. Look like big molds. <laughs> huh? Oh. Jeepers. Oh, is that like a dog where have spring from? What do we do? He's not like the big softies just now. He's itching for a fight. Proper savage. Let's run away. No, use that stick you got by there. Give him a whacking and send him packing. Huh? Give uh, him a whacking and send him packing. Uh, <laughs> Look, lately, he's making his move. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Am I supposed to do something? Okay, rough. Rough? Come on. <laughs> okay, oh, A to attack. Okay. All right, okay, we know the health points. All right, that's your magic points. All right, so the green is health, blue is magic. All right, that's Ruff's health, I'm sure. Yep, okay, attack. Okay, just use that to select attack from your choice. Okay, cool, simple enough. Yeah! Oh my gosh! <laughs> okay, now we have to block. Okay, cool. Oh! I don't, I don't know how I feel about that I'm beating this dog. Or whatever this is. Oh, oh, oh. 
<laughs> Alright, cool. This poor guy <laughs> lost his mom three days ago. He just had to beat this thing. This poor kid. <laughs> no sugar coating in, in his world. He's gotta grow up. Uh, I think it's a dog. I don't even know if it's a dog. Whatever, this creature. First off, we need to get you a wand. But I already have a wand. You're having a laugh, aren't you? That thing's about as magical as a <laughs> flipping cabbage. <laughs> you might just squeeze a gateway spell out of it, but you can forget about anything more than that. Honestly, <laughs> so I wish you. We open a door open to another mouth. world, and that's I'm all we sorry. get out of it. Now, I think I, I think it did pretty good. Dell was just over by yonder, didn't I? Well, if we're very lucky, we might find a wand with a bit more oomph down by there. Oomph. So, are wands really so hard to find here? Well, time was you couldn't move for the flipping things. But since Shadar showed up, magic's taken a real nosedive. He banned people from using it, see? Cursed anyone who tried to. He scared them all so much, they gave it up. So, he's pretty scary, huh? Well, he turned me into a flipping doll, didn't he? <laughs> Just saying his name's enough to make most folks prick it. Still, I see, gotta be a doll have, and like, I'm a in his in nose there. No one wants to be broken-hearted. Broken-hearted? Mm. Like sad? Like... Sad? Worse than that. Oh, Much oh. worse. It's when he steals a morbid. piece of a person's heart. Poor beggars don't know whether they're alive or dead. That's no Aww. way to live, man. That's so, so that's true. why they're all so scared of him, huh? We the can't let him go on yesterday. doing this. Well, it's not a matter of letting him, is it? It's not like people flipping enjoy it. That's why I brought you here, innit? You might just <laughs> be able to stop him, see? You really think I can? Of course you can! You are the pure-hearted one! And the legends say that the pure-hearted one will drive away the darkness! We'll teach you a few tasty spells and you'll be ready to face him in no time! <laughs> tasty Sound spells. Sound good to you? Just... <laughs> okay. I'll of how he's ready to spar at any time. <laughs> of course you will! And that's why we need to find you a better wand! Yee! Alright. Let's head for Ding Dong Dell. Ding Dong Tidy. Dell. Tidy. <laughs> All right, so we have to go to that castle. That's where we're going. All right, so I think this is a great place to stop and um, go ahead and definitely watch the next video. Um, I, I kind of want to split these up since they are so far apart, but I think this is a good place to save the game. Um, we'll go ahead and just leave it like that and just end the game where he has turned the game audio down. But yeah, let me know what you guys think down below. Um, let me know why you want to play this game. Are you here just for the storyline for Studio Ghibli or are you here to actually play the game or a little bit of both? I'm more here for the storyline. I'm actually really excited though. I was kind of like underwhelmed at first about the game portion of it. I was like, oh, I just really want to kind of want to watch this and Studio Ghibli is so new to me in this past year. Um, so I was really eager to watch this, but now playing it, I'm super excited. Ah! Oh no, now I have to fight somebody. Oh my gosh, while well, I'm trying to quit. <laughs> Let's go ahead and finish this off. Let's fight this guy. All right, okay, okay. So we have to attack. Ah! Okay, 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 I'm trying. Oh my god, it's a little noise. <laughs> okay, but isn't it really sad? His mom just died three days ago. And now he's like killing off these things. This poor kid is like traumatized. So yeah, so let me know what you guys think down below. I'm going to continue. Um, I'm going to make a whole uh, series of the entire game all the way up until the end. But I definitely want to, I don't want to keep you guys too long. At least we can split it up into parts. Because um, it is at 47 minutes now. Um, so make sure you comment down below. Um, let me know what you guys think of this. Let me know some history of Studio Ghibli. I love learning new things about Studio Ghibli. As you see uh, above me, um, behind me, I've got my fiance, the Studio Ghibli. Um tapestry not too long ago so we love it i'm so happy you introduced me to the world and i love the fantasy of it i'm super grateful that the time that it entered my life that it did because i needed it more than anything all right so i love you guys thank you so much for watching make sure you go to the next episode so you can continue finishing off the game okay love you guys this is chasing sense